What's up, y'all? What's up? I'm back. It's your boy, DJ Four Legs. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. And I need y'all to do me a favor. I need y'all to comment, share, click that like button, and subscribe to this channel. If you don't do nothing else, do that for me right quick. All right? Just make a comment. Right? Share it on your page. And just click that like button. And make sure you hit the subscription button. All right? And hit all post notifications. I appreciate that out of y'all. Man, I'm out here in Bolingbrook right next to my hometown of Joliet. I'm right here in Bolingbrook, man. And, man, it is hot out here. Yes, it's in the 80s right now. It's like 84, 85. You know what I mean? I got the AC on. I ain't playing with them. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I was at work, but I had to come do my other job. Y'all know I make them t-shirts. I make the best t-shirts in the city of Chicago. That's I'm telling you. City of Joliet, I'm the t-shirt man. Yes, now I don't do that airbrush stuff. That's I leave that to the artists who can paint. I ain't no painter. I ain't no drawer. But I can show design something on that computer. You know what I'm talking about? So, uh, that's what I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to do uh, some t-shirts. <laughs> I'm out here at this big t-shirt mill. Now, this is a t-shirt fact. They go all the way down there. They got so many t-shirts, hoodies, you name it. They got it and they go all the way over there. Yes, sir. It's big, y'all. It's big. Very, 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 very big. You know what I'm saying? So, the t-shirt mill is popping. And they got a big sign. I'm going to show it to y'all in a minute. They hiring. So, if you need a job and you're in the Joliet, Bolingbrook area, or if you're in Chicago, uh-uh. I had just ate y'all. Uh, or if you're in Chicago, you want to take that little drive out here to Bolingbrook. Look, they hiring. I'm telling you, I'm going to put the phone number up and everything. It's called Alpha Broder. You know what I'm saying? Alpha Broder. Y'all come on out here. They do, They hiring. I'm telling you, they got a big ass balloon. Say they hiring. They trying to get some people in here because them t-shirt orders coming in, back to school, finna the jump off. Christmas, all that good stuff. They need people, man. They need good, reliable people. You need your job. You need your nine to five. Just came home from prison. Don't say it ain't no jobs out here. If you just came home from prison, this you, this you. Be honest with the people. Say, look, just give me a chance. I just come home. I'm trying to make a difference. I'm trying to change. I'm just trying to put food on the table. Be honest with the people. You get a job. They gave me one. I'm a felon. They gave me one. I, when I came home from the joint, I had a job two weeks later. I ain't never not had no job. I don't get no damn by no background. It's you that don't want no job. That's what that is. You talking about them people don't like you and you got a background. Look, man, let me tell you something. I know people that got robberies. I know people, I know, I got, I know somebody that work at the post office that got a murder. Got a murder on his background. And he did time for the murder. And he worked at the post office right now. Right now. Been there for years. He got out the joint and he begged them people to give him a chance. He said, you give me 90 days, I'll show you who I really am. I'm not that person that went to jail X, Y, Z long time ago. And I'm telling you, man, been at the post office ever since. You know what I'm saying? So if you want a job, man, you got to ask for it. And you got to let these people know you're sincere. Be sincere. The same way you were sincere on the block. Be sincere about coming to work. You check that bag. It's about getting the bag, man. That block shit old, man. Ain't nobody doing that shit no more, man. That block shit is old and played out. Nobody doing that shit, man. Nobody doing that shit, man. Go to work. Get you a bag. Go start your own company like me. Get you a bag. You know what I'm saying? I done took care of my kids, sent them to college, everything. My kids don't call me to my daddy. Give me this. Give me this. You know why? I taught them how to get out there and get that bag. All my kids get that bag. My daughter work and she a singer. My other daughter a teacher and got them and she got them just had a baby. And she got them to run her, uh, she big top dog with her group. You know what I'm saying? Her, her sorority group. You know what I'm saying? My my son, my junior, my uh, uh, my big Tony. My big Tony got them a uh, uh, basketball player all overseas and shit. Everywhere, man. Uh, anywhere he go, goddamn, it's like gold. You know what I'm saying? He he don't want for nothing. He come pick me up last week, shit. You know what I'm saying? Pick me up, put me in his truck. He took me for a ride and we kicked it. You know what I'm saying? Now, all my kids, man, my junior, he doing his motherfucking thug thizzle. You know what I'm saying? 
Even my kids through marriage, they doing their thing. You know what I'm saying? They at work, they doing their thing. Hey man, look, you have not because you ask not and you ain't got up off your motherfucking ass to get it. Now I ain't gonna say it no more. Get up off your behind and go get it. There you go, there you go. There you go, he's showing off. Showing off. Yeah, he got that little, got that little hoop that he's showing off. Yup. Let me see, who the hell is this? Man, I don't want to talk to that. Man, I'll call him back later. Man, people always call you when you're in the middle of, uh, uh, you did. Man, I don't want to talk to him. Hold on, let me get rid of this call. Yeah. So, that's what it is, man. You know, uh, you got to get up off your ass and go get it, man. And, you know, I'm this your man, Bole. I ain't going to tell you nothing wrong, man. One thing y'all I got to know about DJ Bole, a.k.a. Mr. Bolez. I'm not gonna tell you nothing wrong. If I, and if I ain't got nothing good to say, I'm gonna shut the fuck up. If I ain't got nothing good to say, I'm gonna shut up. Sometimes it's good to shut the fuck up. Man, your business. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, let's show y'all the phone number and everything for the fact y'all give me a second because I ain't got my mouth. Matter of fact, I'm gonna cut it off and I'm gonna come back. All right? I'm gonna try to cut it off and I'm gonna come right back. Peace. I'm back, I'm back. Look, I told y'all I was going to show y'all. Look, they got this big-ass balloon right here. Yep, it say now hiring. Y'all see it? Real big. There it is, right over there. Alpha, that's the front door. Alpha roller. Sweet A right there. Go in there, get your application. Or you probably can do it online. Oh, I see a phone number on here. Hold on, let me pull over here. I see a phone number, y'all. I'm going to do it better. I'm going to get y'all a phone number. How about that? Yes, sir. I'm going to get y'all a phone number. That is 1-800. Oh, that's for the balloon service. Oh, that's for the for Big Sky Balloon Service. But look, this Alpha Broder, y'all see it right over there in the corner. Alpha Broder. Right over there in the corner. Come out here. It's in Bowling, bro. Come on out here and get you a job. They hiring. Big ass balloon say they hiring right there. You see it. So y'all, if you want a job, come on get you one, man. They got it right here. They got another sign, blue sign right there by the door. Say they hiring. Get you, get you a job, man. You want a job? It's right here waiting on you. Right here waiting on you. You gotta come on out here and get it. Get it like you live, baby. Alright? So this your boy DJ Bullet. I'm finna sign off right now. I'm gonna come back to y'all, get y'all a little highway footage. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I gotta go make another run. All right, peace. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back, y'all. We on this crowded ass expressway. Y'all see it? It's packed out here. It is fucking packed. It's moving on the other side. Oh, shit. Westbound. It's packed. I told y'all gonna bring y'all some driving footage. We out here. Uh, 290 East, 290 East. We're on 290 East, that's where we at. And we rolling. Uh-oh, for that Dodge, for that Dodge. Y'all like them Dodges. Y'all love to tear them up too. My man be showing them down there in Atlanta on his YouTube page, showing all the Mopars being, being the uh, auction. They be tore up. Uh, salvaged yeah why y'all let's ask a question put it in the comments to answer this question why is there so many Mopar cars in the junkyard and in the salvage uh, auction why somebody answer that question for me I don't know it is so many Dodge Durango's, Dodge Chargers, Hellcats, uh, Red Eyes, Scat Packs. There's so many of them in the, uh, in the junkyard and in the salvage auction yard. There'd be a bunch of them in there. My man be showing them all the time. They go on right there, what that is? That is a, oh, that's a regular charge. Just a regular old charger right there. That's a Mopar though. That's the B6. 
Look at the Honda Civic. Gonna last to the end of time. The Honda built a damn good car. I don't care what nobody say. I just never bought one because they sit low to the ground. Real low. You know what I'm saying? I never bought one. That's the only reason because they sit so low. Yeah. And here we is by the graveyard. That's my job, y'all. That's my job over there. That's where I work at. See that big ass crane right there? They fixing, they going to the graveyard right there. Sir, big time graveyard. Forest Park Cemetery. Okay, y'all little noise on that sky. Y'all little noise on that on that charger. Yep, they go to the graveyard over there. Alright, I'm gonna get back to y'all. I'm gonna get back to y'all in a minute. I just wanted to give y'all some driving footage. They go to the graveyard right there. Green yard right over there. Yes, sir. There it is. Big monuments. That's my exit right there. But I'm not getting off. That. I got shit to do. All right, I'm going to come back to y'all a little bit later. Come back to y'all a little bit later when I get to my next destination. Peace.